What, what church do we have now? What was the church he set up? He started his own church. Thank you. Well done. House point seven feet. My pencil. I'm not taking my pencil off the page, so I'm keeping it nice and even. There's no white showing through. You can't see the pencil off, really. You can if it's magnified, unfortunately, but. We can't escape from the art, can we? We can't escape from the comfortable. And we shouldn't be ashamed of it, we should just accept that this is who I am. Um, so, anyway, let's not keep it. So, with bulbous fingers, what's it suggesting about his hands? Bulbous, Harry. Yes, that's an interesting idea. Why do you think kind of working with glass oranges? But let's think back to. triggering event, so the crime being committed, that sets everything in motion to see someone being murdered. So as we know in Romeo and Juliet, it starts with a prologue. What is a prologue? What's the purpose of a prologue? <laughs> Asha? Um, a purpose of a prologue is to set the scene and set the story ready up. Perfect. Write that down then if you teach them. That's it. Okay, so he's, yeah, I'm happy with that. I'm happy with the bag. Oh, no, guys, I need super glasses in here. I can't actually see. Yes, yes.